more lunch breaks. So I heard you were riding this weekend, Wes? Uh, riding. No. Yes. Dirty. I don't know. I don't know how to no, ride. I always ride dirty. Riding dirty. I don't even know what that means, actually. Like, does that mean like your your car is like dirty or something? That's, Maybe. That's what it means. It needs a car wash. <laughs> no, I was writing. I was trying oh. to. Oh, so you you were riding dirty. Yes. No, that's yeah. that's the worst. It was actually very difficult though. And you know yeah. what? Like actually the hardest part for me is like starting the, the writing process because mm -hmm. you have to choose the character's names. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I have the document open and I'm ready to start. I'm like, wait, what am I gonna call these people? <laughs> yeah, yeah, writing a name is definitely really, really difficult. Because then you start getting attached, right? If you choose the name, you can't be like, well, I'll just put a place It'd mm -hmm. be John and Jane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then you start getting attached to John and Jane. And when you change it, you'll be like, well, who are these people? Mm -hmm. And so, to like screenwriters, these characters are like their babies. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So how are you gonna choose your baby's names for this story? Like, it's well, just hard to start. If you're Taylor, you just write Taylor. Yes. Because he just puts himself in everything. <laughs> Taylor's uh, son or daughter is gonna be called Taylor Jr. Girl or guy, because he has a yeah. unisex name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never met, Oh no, I have met a guy actually, but only once. It's not that common. Was it spelled the same way? I think he was E. People spell my name A-S-H-E-L-Y a lot. I don't know, but do your names get ever misspelled? Get spelled wrong? Yeah. Yeah, today I went to Starbucks and they, my name is Chris. <laughs> Um, and they, they, spelled, they spelled C H I S. Chiss! Chiss! That doesn't sound Chiss. similar to you? Chiss. Maybe not. <laughs> I get Westley a lot. They add a T. Oh, Westley. I, I, I know a Westley. A lot, yeah. And oh, I that's also get Westley. Mm. Oh, you get it too. Mm, I, just, I take the safe route and I just say Ben. Has oh, anyone spelled it S A M? <laughs> <laughs> ben Sam. Ben Sam. Phil talked about this in a previous lunch break, how he got his name. Because his sister's name is Phyllis. Right? Oh, I felt so bad when he told us that because he's like, yeah, my sister's name is Phyllis. I'm like, Phyllis, really? So I'm curious, how did you guys get your names? Out of a book, it says top 100 names to call your baby. <laughs> What, 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 what number? Was yeah, what number was yours? Mine was like number number one. <laughs> <laughs> number one. <laughs> okay, because I was gonna say if it, if it was like number thirteen or something, it's like why did they, why, why did they choose like yeah. what happened to the other? Exactly. I think it was like number one or number two. Because mm -hmm. like every decade or every few years, like they because it's based on popularity and mm -hmm. like I think now it's like Michael or John or something like that. Mm -hmm. By the time it I was. It was like Christopher. Unique. They're very biblical. Yeah. Yeah, very, very biblical. So it's Greek for Christ bearer. So somebody who bears Christ. Oh, I thought you meant like a Christian bear. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you mm. yours? I have a very long-winded mm -hmm. explanation for this. Basically, my mom, she decided to name me Ashley because it means calm and reserved. Really? Didn't happen. Hmm. Kind of like going against the grain. But at the time, it was funny. My mom and her sisters were pregnant at the same time. So they all wanted the name Ashley. And whoever was born first got the name. Hmm. So, winner. Did she name you that wanting you to be that? I think she projected a certain life and then I trolled her for the rest of my life by being anything but. All right, how did you get your name? I forget the story actually. <laughs> well, your brother's name is Brian. Hey, okay, thank you. <laughs> my mom told me that my dad actually named my brother Brian, which was like a I think it's common name. Brian's pretty common. common. Pretty common, yeah. And then uh, obviously my name is Wesley, which is maybe a little less common. And I think that I asked my parents once what other names they cons considered. Mm -hmm. I remember they, they said Walter. That's my grandpa's name. Is it? Yeah. The thing is, I asked when I was very little, and I, I forget if it was like Walter or Walter. It reminds me of the movie The Tuxedo with Jackie Chan, and he mixed up Walter and Water. That's so it was the Walter. Water Strider. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. That let's say if they wanted to call me Walter. Yeah. Then I guess my nickname would be Wally. Mm. Which I love that movie and I highly relate to that robot. Mm. I mean, I like my name. I think a lot of people uh, might not like their name, but mm -hmm. I actually enjoy it. Nice. I don't know why you wouldn't like your name unless it were like Apple. Or There's, wait, who's the Apple? There's an that's Apple. That's Gwyneth Paltrow's yeah, daughter. Gwyneth Paltrow Apple. and Chris Martin. Like, There's a weird factor now, right? Everyone's just trying to be weird. Uh, sorry, I mean, it's not a weird name. It's a fruity name. I think creative. they want to be, yeah, creative. And Creative. be like individual right. for like, their kids. Like Northwest. Mm. Oh, I mean, so my name means, I think it has like British origins. English origins. English, thank you, English yeah. origins, and it, it means uh, the West Fields. Benson, how do you get your name? All right, <laughs> so I'm the youngest in my family. I have two older brothers, Wesley and Brian. Mm -hmm. Coincidence. So Wesley is my oldest brother, mm -hmm. and he's the firstborn of our generation. And the mm -hmm. first to be born here, like after my family immigrated here. So my uncle, my mom's older brother, I believe, gave him the Chinese name of Wang. 
which is the same as Phil's last name. Mm. So I guess it means king, right? So then they, they took the W from Wang and then I guess created Wesley from that somehow. Okay, science. <laughs> and then four years later, my second older brother came along and his name's Brian. So his name is all cool because they took the B and R from brave. So oh. Brian is brave. Oh. Then a year later, I was born. My dad's name is Ben. <laughs> and so. you're his son? Wait, really? No, that's a lie. Okay. Uh, <laughs> my dad's name is Andy. Your dad's name is Andy? But uh, they also got my name from a book of baby names. Oh, mm. yeah. But like, the A section, I think, was ripped out, so she only got like a couple pages in and <laughs> stopped that Benson. Wait, your brothers have like all this epic story of how they got their names and yours is, eh, it's from a baby book. Yeah. You know those Asian dad memes or Asian parent memes? Yeah. yeah. It's like, why are you Benson and not Ensign? Oh. Why are you Christopher, not Astopher? Astopher. You got it right. <laughs> Ashley actually got it right with the A. Thanks, Mom. I like the name Benson. So if you had a baby brother, would it be would he be named Benson? If I had a baby or a brother or a baby brother? A baby brother. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, you don't get to choose your baby. Yeah, I, I wouldn't get to choose. Oh, yeah. So now we know the origin of our names. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In an alternate reality, yeah. what would your name be? If you could choose. I, I have never put much thought into... On the spot, right now. All right, pass, Ashley. Yeah. I, actually, I pretty, I kind of like my name. I think I would keep it. But that wasn't the question. <sighs> um, I would steal the name that I would think about naming one of my kids. Okay. So it'd be like an Emma or a Brooke. An Emma? No. An Emma. <laughs> Brooke or Emma? Brooke or Emma. Mm -hmm. Those are really nice. Those are very zen or names, just, again, or, not me. Or just Emma Brooke. What do you like about those names? Just the sound? Kind of. They seem like collected, put together people. You know, they kind of like, know what they're doing. Kind of like Ashley sounds like a, a calm and exactly. reserved person. Exactly. So. <laughs> So when I was younger, I remember one of my classmates' names, well, his nickname was AJ. Mm. And I was Wanna like- Wanna be AJ Raphael? Back in time a little bit more. It was like, your name is just like letters. Like, I thought that was like so cool, so I wanted to be named AJ. Mm -hmm. And also like the cool guy from Backstreet Boys is was AJ. AJ. Mm. <laughs> so- He also had a lot of problems. Yeah, but I stuck with Benson. In your alternate reality, what does AJ stand for? I don't know, they're just letters. <laughs> like, that's what I thought his name was at the time. I guess his name ended up being like Alex or something. You could be um, BS for Benson. <laughs> Doesn't have the same ring. No, I, I can see the logic in that. Like being a kid, like, oh, you got you got two letters as your name? I think I got it. Okay. So it'd either be Philip or Andrew. No, it would not. Whoa. Wait, no, what? it would not. What? Philip. Wait, really? Philip with one L or two L's? With one. When you met Phil Philip, you're like, oh, that's a name that I actually like a lot. Well, those aren't names that I would name my kids though. For you. You wouldn't yeah. wish that upon anyone else but yourself. It's like, I would be that name, but never for my children. Yeah. Wow. Wait, why is that? I have other names for, for children. Mm. Hmm. I like the name, um, out of like my friend's names growing up, uh, my friend Terrence. Mm. I, liked, I liked his name. Would you be a Cherry? No, it's a Terrence. Oh, you classy. Yeah. And then uh, I also like the name Garrett, Gareth, or Garrick. I don't know why. Garrett. I met all three of those people. Yeah. They're all pretty cool. Just names that you look like. I feel okay. like people do that names a lot. look like. So once someone told me that I didn't look like an Ashley. Instead, I looked like a skipper. Skipper. I was gonna say Stephanie, but I guess Stephanie. I guess skippers. Skipper I, is like a, a, a boat captain. Kind of. It is a boat captain or the, the team manager of a baseball team. I think I've also gotten a Rachel. Okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. Ashley's actually just like skipping through a field like, hey, skipper. <laughs> What? Don't call me that. You look like a Rachel to me. More than a Stephanie? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you look like a Sammy. Oh, Sammy. Sammy, Sammy. stop. Two M's Chris. and one M. What? No, it's a Jersey Shore reference. Oh. oh. <laughs> Haven't seen it. Sammy, Kevin. Kevin. Yeah. <gasps> I can see a Kevin. I can kind of see a Daniel. Kevin. Daniel. Uh, hmm. Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> I think your name's Jen. <laughs> I feel like you could be an Elliot. Ooh, I can see. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why. Or Eugene. I can see an Alan. It's like Eugene name. Alan, Eugene? Yeah. <gasps> you look like an Ethan. Oh, wait. I think I've gotten that. Mm. Someone's actually mm. said that to me. I see that. You know, you've renamed yourself. You could do things differently. To start off right, mm -hmm. what would you name your kids? Okay. If I had two sons, it okay. would be Alexander. Oh, okay. The Great. And uh, Alexander. <laughs> and another son would be probably William. But if I had two daughters, they would be Olivia. Newton John. Or um, Elizabeth. Hurley. 
<laughs> when did this become an association? <laughs> that's the challenge that's, with names, that's though. That's what happens, is you think of these things and like, mm. do I want them to be William Shakespeare? So, you didn't have any combination where you had a son and daughter. Okay, if it's then, son and daughter, then it would be Alexander and Olivia. That means those are your top of the two. Yeah. That means those are your favorite kids. Like, <laughs> you would shun William. You <laughs> shun can't William. be Alexander the Great. I feel like very proper names. Mm -hmm. I think Olivia and Elizabeth, they're like, they're feminine names, but they're very they're strong, strong names. They're very strong, strong names. Yeah. You know why? Why? I think because there's a lot of syllables. Mm, maybe. Like you actually have to put work in saying the name. Like Olivia is such a short word, but there's like there's structure. Three, there's like three or four syllables in there. Yeah. I don't think I have anything thought of for my kids as as set as you do. Do, do you, mm -hmm. Ashley? Um, do you know? Uh, over the past few years, kind of figured it out. I would say for daughters, it would be like Emma or what would I say the other one was? Brooke. I really like Emma and Brooke. For girl names and then for guy names i really like i know aiden was one of them mm -hmm. i that's like a pretty basic answer though that was very a lot popular of people, yeah very like popular aiden. Aiden, it just yeah. sounds like such a cute name would it be a cute name if they're like 35 years old and you're like <laughs> that's 80? what you have to think about too is like emma would be a cute old lady and a cute young girl and then would aiden still be cute i think so okay. you know but aiden, like it ages well aiden like, feels like a model name i would consult my wife and see what what, what ideas she well, has there's this great book yeah that. What's it called? There's Maybe a lot of words I don't know. It. The cover was ripped off. You know, <laughs> you know there's like these baby name books, right? And stuff mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. And then there's also websites now. Um, yeah. But actually... Some random name generator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean... <laughs> Childish Gambino. Just uh, Childish Gambino <laughs> got his name. For names, I actually just go to Facebook. And you would name them after one of your friends? The trending Maybe? name. Yeah. Oh. But what's also great is Facebook is like global. So you get names that, you know, are, are from different regions, which mm -hmm. is really nice too. I don't have an answer to that question. Mm. <laughs> you know what uh, uh, What name I like? I, I like the name Iris. Mm. Iris. That's a good name. Yeah. I think mine's pretty obvious. Are you No. Oh. <laughs> Not obvious then. It'd be uh, Ben Sun Sun. <laughs> <laughs> what if you have a daughter? Ben Sun Daughter. <laughs> <laughs> because you haven't had this son yet, mm -hmm. is the temporary name Ben Soon? Ben Soon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now that you guys know the story behind our names, we'd love to hear yours. And we're lucky to have so many fans around the world, so I'm sure you have some really creative stories, or if not, uh, maybe they just got your name from a book, and that's just as good. So yeah. leave your stories in the comments below. See you guys next week. Thanks. Bye.